This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. It's Liverpool. They take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. <laughs> Hello everyone, Anfield looking radiant today, the sun shining brightly. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we're getting down to the wire in the UEFA Champions League. Tonight, the first leg of the semi-final coming right up. It is Liverpool taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. Take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander Arnold in the fullback positions. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Diogo Jota. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Luka Modric plays with Toni Kroos in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. semi-final first leg McAllister and given away and this might not be the ideal situation for them Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? And he's fired over the corner. Defended well. Andrew Robertson cross fired over well they can keep possession now well Mo Salah knows how to light up any game I think it's fair to say Stuart well Derek over the years he scored so many goals it's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defenders at such pace when the ball's played in behind nobody catches him and he often gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper and we know what the result is Chance to play it in. Not a poor ball and easy for the keeper.
Possession lost. Vinicius Jr. On to Carvajal. Fabinho and Diaz has it options in the centre and the frustration for those waiting in the middle Jude Bellingham and it's played into the centre and in fact a bit too close to the goalkeeper and that was always going to be claimed Fabinho Van Dijk with it Alexis McAllister how far from the ideal pass you've got to say Tony Kroos now with Bellingham, Vinicius Junior, Camavinga, still level here, but the pressure escalating, Vinicius might jump in front, and a little bit too much height on that one. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Andrew Robertson. Shot up. Just fractionally wide. So unfortunate. Vinicius Junior. Could do damage. Oh dear, a moment to forget all about, I think. Well, he has to do a lot better there. He's gone for power, but he's completely miscued it. Andrew Robertson. Luis Diaz and the referee says play on advantage Liverpool Robertson just cutting off the supply oh he's really opened them up here oh but brilliantly read to cut it out it looks so promising Fabinho now with Bellingham it might be and quite simply a wonderful chance was squandered Alexis McAllister there will be one minute added on at the end Liverpool have given it away 
Well, they've given him too much space. Can he put them in front? And a goal! The opening statement in this semi-final. How important could that prove to be? Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. No more time left. First half is over here at Anfield. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, after a slow start where he was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first half went on, and he got his reward with that goal. I'm looking forward to his second half display. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Corner kick played in. No full marks to him for that header, but the goalkeeper did his job. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. And it's in! Real Madrid firmly in charge here. Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So 2 0 now. Tiago. Oh, what's he gone and done? Might be dangerous. It could be up for grabs. Well, they can bring it out now. Roselu. Modric. Real find themselves in a position of menace. Can he take the chance? A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So the action continues and Real very much bossing the proceedings. Jude Bellingham. Well, he's lost the ball. 
and into the last 30 minutes now Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick Well, as you can see, he gets there first, he makes good contact with the ball and finds the back of the net. That's a decent header. And this is turning into something of a rout, 4-0. Andrew Robertson, Luis Diaz. And slipped through beautifully. It could be... And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. And the flag has gone up. Well, he has to work a lot harder to stay onside there. He didn't read the situation at all. Vinicius Junior. Oh, a nice looking pass. He's in position. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Substitution for Real Madrid. <laughs> Who can he pick out? Well, not cleared away completely. Rudiger, able to get a body in the way. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. And fired over by Kroos. And the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Substitution for the visitors. Coming off the pitch. Number nine, Chateau. To be replaced by number 21, Brahim. Well, he's bound to be disappointed with himself. Not a great effort, Stuart. Well, the less said about that, the better. Not a good decision from him. Trent Alexander-Arnold. McAllister, Alexander Arnold, Salah, Alexis McAllister. Now Mo Salah. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And now passing it through. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now.
Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, a bit short with the clearance. Diaz. Here's Kors. Just the challenge that was required. Out for a Liverpool throw. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Ibrahima Konate. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. And it's played into the centre. Oh, he squandered the chance, and he knows it. Well, it wouldn't have counted anyway. He was offside, but nonetheless, that was a poor attempt. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Diaz. Breaking at pace. Well, it fizzled out. Well, wait, don't go anywhere. We're going to have five additional minutes. Vinicius. Well, far from the ideal pass. Plenty of support here. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Salah. Alexander-Arnold. And so, there goes the full-time whistle. And Real Madrid will carry a lead into the decisive second leg. Well, they were really good today. Their approach play, their movement off the ball, and of course their finishing were excellent, as was their work rate. A disciplined performance in the second leg, and they're into the final. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat, and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.